get with you uh, This no free car, that's so rental Spin your blocks and shots out the window Free my dog up out that candle Top story at 6, Taekwon Bowman, better known as the Savannah rapper Quando Rondo, pleading guilty to a federal drug charge in court. With that guilty plea comes a sentencing date of December 12th here at the federal courthouse. And until then, the judge is permitting Bowman to remain out on bond. This one made me take my shahada. Me knowing, like, man, I gotta, I, I gotta do something with my life, man. I gotta get close to the higher power. Despite most inmates being Christian, that Muslims had the largest influence out of every other group, and that could be attributed to their very strong and harmonious bond with one another. If you hurt one of them, you'll have to pay a heavy price. Many Muslims stick together and protect each other regardless. If you hurt a Muslim inmate, many of them will make sure to get revenge for their brothers. In the next couple months for this Fed case, for controlled substance and being part of a street gang. He took a plea. It's up to the judge to give him how much time you want to give him. I think his max is like five years. So man, he don't got no record. So it's not looking too bad for him. He'll probably get around the same time that YB got. YB got like 27 months. Young boy got like 27 months. So he'll be home in about a year and a half in the halfway house. You gotta go to the halfway house when you get out the feds, but Rondo Rondo, man, he, he done turned Muslim, man. He know that when he get in that prison, he gonna need protection. Illinois card, that Chicago card, cause you know, a lot of them Chicago dudes be catching fed cases. One of Duke just came home from the feds. Liam Ron, little Steve just came home from the feds. So they in the feds. And now the uh, Muwap and them will be in the feds in the whole O Block 5, O Block 6. So and Pooh Shiesty's in the fed. He's going to be running into a lot of people, man. He's not going to go to a little camp. You know, he high profile, high security risk. So he's going to go to the USP most likely. One of them maxes. It ain't no joke in there, man. They be stabbing in there. Real deal with like kitchen knives. You know, he a hundred pounds. So a lot of Vaughn people in there. It's a lot of different problems he got. So he turns Muslim right before he goes in. Yeah, I never seen him even talk about Muslim nothing until just now when he, after he caught this case, man. And after he took this time, really, like the last month, you seen him going on a Muslim tour. N not saying it's not wrong with it, but you you could tell that was just for a protection once he got behind the wall. So that, cause you know, they not gonna let nothing happen to him or if, or they'll go with him. Probably not a lot of Savannah people and whatever fat spot he lands in. A lot of people be doing that. When they go to jail, turn Muslim, you know, they, they got a real brotherhood in there. Police even be calling them a gang, but they ain't no gang, but they stick together for sure. So he got to go sit down for a couple years. I don't think that was genuine. That was just some protection. Y'all leave a comment. Let me know how y'all feel about it.